Welcome ladies and gentlemen to today's practical which is uh, looking at speed and to calculate speed what we use is we use a ticker timer and this is a ticker timer here it's basically a, a device that measures how fast um, a piece of tape that is pulled through is uh, traveling it's essentially uh, when you connect it up to the uh, power pack you use the yellow AC terminals and, and and then you place it on to 12 volts but essentially what it is is we have a piece of carbon paper here uh, we use a piece of tape that we put underneath the carbon paper so when this arm of the ticker timer moves down and it does that uh, 50 times per second it leaves a small blue spot um, on the piece of paper as you can see there and we use these to be able to measure speed um, and we also use them to be able to uh, measure acceleration so let's have a look at one in action as normal uh, the experimental write-up will come on the screen now if you'd like to pause the video and then uh, copy that down and then start up when you are set to go Okay, well here we go, here's our ticker timer that's already been set up, it's, it's got our piece of carbon paper in there, it's got uh, the tape underneath, and what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to pull the tape through, and what will happen is every 1 50th of a second this arm will strike the paper leaving a dot on the page. Now unfortunately with the ticker timer, uh, very loud, and, and it's one of the uh, pieces of equipment that most science teachers dislike because of it. So I'm I'm going to pull the tape through now um, and that will then register how fast it is going. Okay, so you can see there that I pulled it through relatively quickly and what you can see on the paper here are the blue dots. It's a little bit hard to see with that one so what I'll do is I'll show you a pre-prepared one here. Here's one uh, that has been pre-prepared for us and it, it leaves in this case the black dots however with the um, actual device it's blue dots. Now the experiment which we were looking at today was to try and work out and define what speed is and there are two factors that are involved in speed and looking from it you can see both of them that are on here. So what you would need to do is to be able to work out what speed is. Now we know one thing that there is a set a distance between each of the dots in this case for constant speed and we also know that the ticker timer struck the piece of tape once every um, once every one fiftieth of a second or 50 times within that one second. So from there what we, we need you to do is to work out and define what speed is and to give you the hint there are two things that make up speed and if you think about it when you go through um, um, like when we travel in in a car how fast we do travel and the terminology that we use you should be able to work it out from there as usual please check in with your science teacher to make sure that you have everything correct um, and have yourself a nice day